yo, what's up? Hi, guys. Welcome back to Shopping Mall with Kimberly and Santos. Today, we are doing Dollar Tree, Dollar General. <laughs> I am just so, like, pumped today. I don't know why. It's like, pop, 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 pop. <laughs> <laughs> I know why. We're going to have um, meatball subs later for Aiden's birthday. Ooh, meatball subs. <laughs> Yeah, our, our middle son, he's turning 12 today, and we're going to cook him a <laughs> fabulous dinner. Um, uh, we always take requests, whatever they feel like eating. Mm -hmm. It's like, whatever you want, let me know, and we make it. Um, this yep. time, we requested meatball subs, so yep. I was like, oh, my baby's growing up. <laughs> <laughs> and he always makes his infamous homemade sauce. It's delicious. <laughs> oh, my God. Can't wait. And then... Uh, Jaden wants calzones. Yeah, for his birthday. So I was like, well, we could use that for a dipping sauce, you know, yeah. and, and I can make the calzones, and yeah, definitely. Yeah, so Aiden's birthday is on the 12th, and then our youngest son, Jaden, his birthday is on the 16th. Uh -uh. So they're a year and four days apart. <laughs> so Isn't that crazy? We're going to be busy bees this week. Bzzz. And then they start school Monday. So. Oh, yeah. Yep. That's right. <laughs> oh, oh, on his uh, birthday. On Jaden's birthday. On Jaden's birthday is their first day of school. So Isn't we're gonna that crazy, crazy. Yeah, we're gonna celebrate his birthday on Friday because he doesn't want to celebrate it on his birthday because it's the first day of school. And don't forget, guys, uh, we have a contest going on. Oh, not a contest. Uh, <laughs> blah, a giveaway. Going, a contest. My bad. Y'all ain't got to run nowhere and cross some lines or anything. All right? Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's a giveaway. We're doing a giveaway, $100 giveaway, uh, because we got to 700 subscribers, and we yep. just like to give back. So we were like, you know what? Let's do the $100 giveaway. So it's almost, the time's almost up. But uh, don't forget to go to the 700 subscriber video. And to enter, don't uh, put what you like or what you're looking forward to with the Halloween release. Yeah, at about Bath the and Body, Body Works. Works. And at the end, put hashtag Halloween. Yes, and it ends on the 14th of yes. August. So you got two more days. And then we got to do the video for that one. Mm -hmm. So good luck to each and every one of you guys. We're super excited. Yeah. And we can't wait to see who wins. Woo so... Enough with our little tangent. <laughs> Let's Boom. get on with the haul. <laughs> All right. We're going to go ahead and start off with Dollar Tree. You want me to go first? You go first. All right. This, I got this cup because I saw it and I was like, you know what? It's kind of cool. It's got Thor and Hulk and Iron Man and Black Widow. It's got the Avengers and it's got Spider-Man. Well, I guess he's an Avenger now. Oh, he is? Yeah. Uh, the last movie, they made him an Avenger. Hmm. Uh, Iron Man said he's an Avenger now, so. I did not know that. Yeah. But I like uh, the color red. And it's red on the inside. You know, I thought it was kind of cool. I was like, I I'm going to get it. Yep. But kids will like it. And I picked up this right here. I'm going to go ahead and use it for our Q-tips and cotton swabs and um, those cotton circle things, little whatever. Pads. They're, yeah, the little pads. So I thought this was pretty cool. It has uh, the two drawers that pop out. Yeah, the other one's getting worn out, huh? Yeah, I want to throw it away. And they also have different colors. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I don't mm -hmm. <laughs> And next, I picked this up. This is a Masters of the Universe toy. And I like to grab these things. This guy's name is Oracle. And I like to grab these things and I collect them. Um, I'm going to end up leaving them for the kids. Yeah. You know, uh, all this stuff is all going to be for the kids one day. Uh, they already know that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, ooh, I want this and I want that and I want this. And I <laughs> So, yeah, this is one of the items I got for it. And I got this Monster Ink. And it's Boo from Monster Ink. And she's got that little costume on when she's hiding <laughs> in the movie. And I also picked up Rando, the little, the evil guy from the movie. Oh, yeah. The, the mean one. Mm -hmm. He's mean. And I got Sully. Had to get Sully, of course, from Monsters Inc. And they had 
most of them. So I got most of them. <laughs> yeah. Mike, what's his last name? How do you say it? Uh, Wazowski. Mike Wazowski. I'm like, he has a last name? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have Roz. He talks like this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought you was funny. I thought that was hilarious. Did you show this one? Sully? Yeah. Oh, you did? Yeah. I oh, okay. Sully. Yeah, I like Sully. Big blue teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I got most of the characters. I don't think they have any more of them. So I think I grabbed all of them. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> you wiped them clean. Yeah. And uh, next year, um, well, y'all know I'm into the bees. So next year for summer, I'm going to be doing... A bee theme in my kitchen. I want to do bees and strawberries. Hopefully. If we have enough funds to get the stuff that I want for it. But. Black and yellow. Black and yellow. <laughs> they, Dollar Tree came out with these um, pretty cool looking candles. It looks like a. Um, what is it called? A honeycomb? Uh -huh. Right? Honeycomb. And uh, they had this color and I believe white. But I chose this one because it looks like a honeycomb. <laughs> Well, the color of a honeycomb. So, yeah. Love it. And next we have here. This <laughs> is um, that floral foam. And Kimberly's going to use this for her DIYs. She puts it in her uh, whatever she needs to stick flowers and all that stuff in. Uh, whatever she's making. She has like a little... What do you call that thing you're making right now? I bought some crates from the Dollar crates. Tree. I will go ahead and link that video down below. So that way y'all can check it out. And I went ahead and I painted it. And I made it uh, rustic looking. And I will go ahead and insert a picture of my DIY that I am doing. But I am going to throw those foam flower, flower foam thingamadoobers inside. So that way I can put my flower arrangement inside. Yeah. Inside of it. And the next thing we picked up was this mini hay bales. And these are new to the DT. You get eight of them. They normally come out with the, the larger ones. But I thought these were pretty cool. They'll be perfect for a tear tray. And she also grabbed these straw bales. Yeah. I think those will mix good with those. Maybe put one on top of these or a little stack. Yeah. And the, these right here are the ones that they normally come out with. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to get the little ones for the tear tray. This... You know what that looks like? It looks what? like hash browns to me. <laughs> what the hell? Hash Am I browns? hungry or something? Yeah. I don't even know. I but think... that looks like hash browns to me. <laughs> I think you are. Hungry. I was like, man, she got hash browns right here. And I mean, why she got hash browns over here? <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> and I finally found this. Uh, oh, my God. I've been looking for this uh, sucker for like a year. A year and a half, maybe. Long time. But this Dollar Tree that I normally don't go to is on the east side of San Antonio. <laughs> they had a lot of them. They had like over 50. So I was like, heck yeah. Something told me to stop at this location because we were driving by. I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and go inside and see if they have it. And lo and behold, they had it. And either they don't sell a lot of crafts there or they just put it out. But there was a lot of yeah. stuff from what I understand. So, we should be going back there to look for stuff when we need stuff. Or I've, when you need stuff for your DIYs. Um, that's what our... We've been in that store a few times already. And every time we go in there, they always have a lot of craft items. So, I don't think that area does a lot of crafting. Probably not. Yeah. That's... So, um, which is a good thing. So, I get to <laughs> find what I need. She got a good list. Hey. Of <laughs> All right, and next we have these little uh, chalkboard stickers. And these are, we could put these on our little chalkboard that we have. We have like that. Or you could put these on. No, uh, those are labels. What? Chalkboard labels. Chalkboard stickers. I know, but you can, they're, they're labels basically. But it's chalkboard, right? Yeah. Yeah, you could put this on. Why would you want to put these? chalkboard on chalkboard? <laughs> Good question. <laughs> I'll come out with an answer and figure that out for you. <laughs> okay. And then let us know. <laughs> I'll, I'll make sure I insert the clip. No, I'm okay. just kidding. <laughs> okay, we'll do that. <laughs> That's a good point. <laughs> 
And to go with the pumpkin wreath, I picked up some decorative mesh. These are six by five yard, six inches by five yards. So I scooped up three of them. Hopefully my pumpkin comes out cute. <laughs> I've been wanting to make it for the longest time. And she got this purple to go with it. No, not to go with that. That's that's this for the is witch's, for the witch's hat. hat. Yeah. Right? Sorry, sorry. This is for the witch's hat that she's yeah. gonna be doing. And this time, not gonna have legs. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not doing the legs this time. She did legs last time. So we're going to change it up. Yeah. Maybe something different. The one that I did last year, I ended up selling it to yeah. one of our good friends, Robert. Hi, Robert. If you're watching, I hope your girl loves it. Um, so I want to do something different this year. So hopefully it turns out good. Oh, I was, oh you, you jumped into that and I, I ended up in just... <laughs> Um... <laughs> This is going to go um, <laughs> on the pumpkin wreath as well. This pattern is new this year for fall 2021. I love the um, plaid pattern that it has. You, baby, baby. Yep. And, okay. <laughs> it's nine feet long. Love it. That's a lot of feet. Mm -hmm. I want to show this one. Okay, go ahead. This one. Look at this. Welcome to our haunted home. And these are new. And the witch is in. They didn't have these last year. No, they didn't. They didn't have anything like that. I was like, this is a really cool one. She, Kimberly showed me these. I was like, nice. Good job picking these out right here. Mm -hmm. And I like the colors. I like the way they're sticking with the same kind of theme. The purple and the black and orange. You know, I mm -hmm. like that. It's a little bit glittery, but it's not coming off. So the fallout's not that bad. And this one says, Welcome to our haunted home. Um, this one I believe I'm going to use in the witch's hat wreath. Because the color scheme I'm going to go for is purple, black, and orange. I love this haunted house. Yeah, I me like too. I like the way that looks. That looks really cool. And the ghosts. The little ghosts, yeah. And the little tombstones. Oh, yeah. And, oh, look, there's tombstones right there, too. Oh, yeah. Huh. That's, That's pretty, pretty cool. Neat. <laughs> <laughs> what you got next? And then these are going to be for the witch's hat wreath as well. So I picked up some spiders. And this is a six piece. They also had green. But I'm going for purple. And we also picked up this little hanging chalkboard. And we got the chalkboard thing going on lately. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I, I guess it does blend in with what we got now. <laughs> <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll yep. figure out a place to put that. And then I also picked up this. Um, it says Wicked. Um, I think I'm going to use it for my witch's hat wreath. Um, I'm not quite sure yet, but I think I am going to use it. We'll see. Yeah. If I do make the wreath, I will insert a clip or maybe I'll do a little DIY. We'll see. Um, I'm not a great wreath maker yet so that's why I haven't been filming myself uh, doing wreaths um, I only made like a couple videos uh, me doing wreaths um, <laughs> see I even get nervous talking about it <laughs> so um, we'll see if I'm gonna end up doing a video she said I'm sweating just thinking about it <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, next we have this uh, kitchen always open self serve. I like this little magnet. It's a magnet, right? Yeah. It's for the fridge. Uh -huh. It's a little fridge magnet. I think that's kind of cute. I like the. Uh, it matches with everything that we yep. have. So I got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, that's Stellar General. Oh. We can still gotta do that. Oh yeah. And this right here, I finally found an eyeshadow palette from Hard Candy. And um, it is called Raining Men 1301. Raining Men, okay. Isn't that a, a, a song or something like that? I don't know. But it says <laughs> Top 10 Eyeshadow Collection. Raining Men 1301. Or is that a Broadway show? I don't know, something like that. <laughs> and it kind of looks like they're all shimmer um, colors. So, uh, 
Not sure how much you're gonna use it. E yeah, cause I don't use all shimmers. I, you know. You like a lot of nudes. Yeah, right? so we'll see. It's a gorgeous palette, either way. I'm gonna test it out, see how it works out. <clears throat> and next we have this carry on paper towel four pack, four dollar four mm -hmm. pack of paper towels. Keep your eyes peeled. I mean, you see this? You grab this. Yeah. Cause I mean that's hard to come by. You know, especially with everything going the way it is. It's been kind of hard to find certain things. It's getting yep. harder. But yes, paper towels, four pack, one dollar. And it's not a um, Greenbrier brand. And it was the last mm -hmm. one on the shelf. So these are flying off the shelf. Mm -hmm. And when the lady was ringing it up, she looked at her screen and she's like, are these really one dollar? <laughs> she thought the system made a mistake or something. I was like, yeah, they're one dollar. I've seen other YouTubers haul them, so I got pretty lucky on that. Okay, that is it for our Dollar Tree. Mm. On to Dollar General. Each year, I like to buy um, different mats for the seasons. And... <laughs> this is our mat for... Yeah, this is this our... Season. Yeah, for this season. It's this one right here. It says welcome and it has the um, gingham, the black and white gingham with the cute pumpkins in the back. I thought it was super cute. And for $10, yeah, you know, I'm picking it up. So. Yep. And it's, it's for outside. So, and it's definitely, heavy. Definitely, definitely. And I like this one over the other one we were looking at. Yeah. I was like, yeah, we got to get this one. They also had like a uh, pumpkin shaped one. Uh -huh. I kind of wanted that one as well, but I was like, eh, I want to. I think this one was better. Yeah, it I goes think with. it suited better with what we have. Yep. Right? Mm hmm. Don't show that. Yeah. <laughs> I got this. You got that. You got this. Here you go, that. I got that. Okay, go. You go, that. Right. Go. Let's go, show go. fall first. All right, let's go with the fall. <laughs> fall with the ball. You see? Well, I don't even know why I said that. <laughs> I'm not even showing a ball here. <laughs> I got a pillow here. A little pillow. Hanging pillow. Take me to the pumpkin patch. Look at that. Aww, Isn't that cute. stinking cute? Look at that. I like the little pumpkins. I love this color pumpkin. We've been loving that color right there. Yeah. We've really been getting into those colors right there. But yeah, it's really cool. Little cute pillow. You can hang like that. On the door. Mm-hmm. It's a, yep, exactly. It's a door pillow mm -hmm. for $2. $2. <clears throat> and last year, I wanted to get one of these, but they were sold out by the time I went to Dollar General. This year, I finally was able to scoop it up, guys. It's a cookie jar, <laughs> and it has the cute little pumpkins, and it has the favorite color that we are digging this year. Literally just talked about. Yep. <laughs> right? And look at the See? blue pumpkins in the back. I love it. We love in this color. This yeah, one. super cute. I'm not sure exactly where I'm going to put it at uh, just yet. I don't know. I think we should like fill it with some guacamole, you know, and put it in. No. <laughs> 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 and it was only $8, guys. $8. Not bad, not bad at all. And I almost didn't see it. Oh, I He's started like, it. babe. Yeah, because I was like... I was like, what? She's been looking for that one yeah. for like the longest time. I was like, uh, babe. I was all <laughs> looking at like, these <gasps> pumpkin... The mat. You were at the bottom with the mat and the things in the middle. Yeah. It was in the middle. It was those pumpkin, pumpkin-shaped things. It looked like a pot with the lid. Oh, yeah. Shaped like a pumpkin. <laughs> yeah, that's right. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to put that back and get this because I wanted yeah. this last year. I'm glad you <laughs> spotted it for me, babe. Yeah. And it was the last one. Yeah. The last one there. Oh, I was show this. No, let's do oh, fall first. first. Yeah. All right. We have this pumpkin patch hay rides pillow. And it's got the truck, the blue truss, got the pumpkins in the back. And it says corn maze and homegrown. Pick your own. And this was $8 for this pillow. And it's got the black and white gingham. Mm-hmm. And we digging these pillows. We digging this color this year. It's going to really go with our color scheme. Yep. With all the decor that we've been getting. Definitely. Definitely. And <laughs> I love how you can use it all year round. 
for fall and for uh, Thanksgiving or whatever, you can have it face this way, and then you can turn it around for Christmas or... You could even uh, put your own picture on the other side. Oh, yeah. You know, there's a lot of things you could do with it. But I think we're just going to go ahead and keep it on our bed because mm -hmm. it matches our... Um, the color of our comforter. Yeah. has the pop of blue. And then yeah. this right here, I picked up this tray. Uh, it's for decorative purposes only. And I'm going to put some cookies on it. No. <laughs> I'm just playing. No, I'm not. <laughs> uh, this one is says autumn harvest, hay rides, pumpkins, and apples. And the it's super cute. I love it. I just wish the truck was blue. But I picked it up anyway because... <laughs> These are going fast, guys. It's super cute. Big truck. Mm hmm And it was only $2. Couldn't pass it up for $2. I don't know. For some reason, we just, uh, uh, the red truck's just not getting old for us. Because mm -hmm. it's got different colors, different styles. So yep. we're digging that. Mm hmm And we have this here is a door cover. It says, boo to you. <laughs> <laughs> See that there? We got the little ghost. We're going to put that on our door. Every year we put a door covering. Yeah. Every year something different. Mm -hmm. We haven't done the same thing, right? The no. whole time. We've been here for a while. Every year we put something different. Yeah. One dollar. Because every year I just rip it off and throw it in the trash Gosh. and get a new one. Got another one. <laughs> so I think that's it, right, babe? I believe so. Yep, that is it, guys. I hope y'all guys enjoyed. If y'all did, give it a thumbs up. And today is the candle sale. It starts today mm -hmm. and it ends on what, the 15th? The 15th. Yeah, ends on the Sunday the 15th. They're 1295. They're going to be 1295 and you can use a 20% off coupon mm -hmm. with this uh sale because it doesn't require a barcode. So that is an amazing deal. The candles are going to come out to like $9, $10 a piece. So hopefully we get to go to the sale because I've been wanting to pick up some Halloween candles. So run. Don't walk. Run. Yeah, you run. Get to this, <laughs> you don't want to miss out on this. <laughs> so we'll talk to you guys in our next video and let us know if y'all going to go to the candle sale. We would love to know. And we'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Have a good one. Bye.